Hey guys, hope all of you are well. In today's lecture, we are going to see some special directives which we often find in the question. Directive means the particular words which necessitates the requirement or demand of the question. But generally, we, we uh, ignore those words and because of our negligence or because of our unawareness regarding those particular directives, we eventually write a wrong answer, thus inviting less marks. That is why it is very necessary to know the exact requirement of the directives. So the directives which we have taken here today are describe, explain and discuss. So here let's begin. Describe means more detail. Explain mean also more detail and discuss means less detail. Now you are get confusing or you are get puzzling. I know that thing and that is why I request all of you to watch the video till the end. Otherwise, if you abrupt the vi uh, video midway, then you will get a wrong conception. So watch the video till the end with little patience so that you can go, uh, secure some good marks in the exam hall. So here it is necessary to know the exact directive of the word detail. What does detail mean? Detail does not he, uh, here indicate words or incidents. More detail does not mean more words or more incidents you have to cover or less detail does not mean that here you have to cover less words or less incidents. Then detail or less detail or more detail here indicate means the area of evidence which you have to cover, the area of necessary facts, the area of necessary information which you have to bring out in your answer. So discuss. When we find the word discuss in question, then it means less detail. Less detail means what? That our answer must have to be based on particular specific evidence to prove a particular point. This is the first point. That when we find the word dis, uh, discuss in our answer, sorry, discuss in question, then our answer must have to be must have to bear some. Our answer must have to be have to convey some particular kind of specific evidence to prove our point. To prove what we are going to write in the answer, we have to bring them with some particular specific evidences. This is called discuss. And here, another important point is when we find our discuss, we have to put up causes, consequences, marriage, and demerge. Right? But we have to here focus pros and cons with much more evidence. That means when we find the word discuss in the question, the question is asking to show the causes consequences, marriage and demerits of that particular aspect with the putting up of some particular evidence. That means when we find the word discuss, we have to prove that, uh, prove the, we have to fulfill the requirement or demand of the question put by putting up, by bringing up some kind of specific or particular data so that with the help of those data, we can bring the uh, we can prove the pros and cons or marriage and demerits or other causes and consequences which are required by the question. Clear till now? Discuss means less detail. Less detail means what? We have to bring some kind of particular evidences or particular uh, aspects. Aspect means particular proof so that with the help of those proof, we can concretely prove up the requirement of the question. Right. What are the causes? What are the consequences? What are the marriage or what are the demerits? Asked by the question, we have to put those require, we have to fill up those requirements of the question by bringing up some particular kind of specific data or some particular kind of specific evidences. Right. This is called discuss. When we say explain, explain means more detail and more detail in what sense? More detail in explain means we have to bring much more relevant information, relevant scientific data or scientific research in comparison to discuss. Discuss means less detail. Less detail means here we have to bring up, put up some one or two particular evidences or one or two particular kind of data to prove our point. But explain means a particular, whenever we find the word explain in question, that means it asks for a kind of clarification. And this clarification will be based on 
examination based and when we say examination based here we have to bring out rigorous data rigorous scientific evidences to prove our point this is one special aspect of the word explain and another important point of the explain is that when we find the word explain in the question then we have to show a particular kind of understanding of that particular concept that means we have to write our answer in such a way so that examiner will get a very thorough understanding of the particular concept right and another important third important point of uh, uh, of this directive is that he, when we find the word explain here we have to bring much more comparison and when here we have to focus much more on the deficiencies or darker aspects or complexities means here we have to focus much more on the complex sides of the topic right and he, we have to prove all these points with rigorous data rigorous information or rigorous scientific study right here clarity of thought is very much necessary and to show this clarity of thought our answer have to be exam examination based examination based means we have to bring up some scientific research data and with the help of this scientific data and research we have to uh, put up a particular kind of understanding of the concept and we have to focus much more on the comparison deficiencies or darker aspects of the topic with uh, uh, putting up some solution clear till now then coming to the describe when we find the word describe describe means more detail more detail means what we have to generally give an account of the incident why it happens how it happens or at least simply putting some solutions right means when we find the word describe here we have to give as a whole as a whole account or a general account of that particular incident showing the causes or why it causes or how it causes and at least bringing up some uh, solution right clear till now describe means general general means as a whole we have to bring the uh, uh, causes or consequences right when we find the word explain explain means it is no general it is not anyway general here we have to bring more scientific data or here we have to bring more uh, specific data science research and with the help of all these research we have to develop a particular kind of understanding towards the concept we have to focus more on the dark, darker aspects we have to focus more on the deficiencies and here clarity of thought is necessary and our answer have to be exam based exam based means here we have to put much more information data to prove our point and when we find the word discuss discuss means we here we have to uh, write in our answer causes consequences merits and demerits but all these points we have to prove with some kind of particular evidences so i hope uh, till now you are clear regarding the meaning or requirement or of these three directives describe explain and discuss discuss means here we have to put up causes consequences merits and demerits of the required aspect with some particular kind of evidences explain means our answer needs some clarification clear understanding of the concept and it also demands what are the complex sides of the question and we have to prove all this with scientific data and particular kind of rigorous information and describe means it asks for as a whole general account of the incident showing the uh, causes why it happens how it happens and simply putting forward a solution but okay, these are some literary meanings कहने का मतलब ये है कि व्हेन वी राइट आंसर्स इन द यूपीएससी एग्जाम वी कैन नॉट रिलीजियसली फॉलो दैट मीनिंग बट वी मस्ट हैव टू एडहियर टू द क्लोज टू द मीनिंग एंड वन पर्टिकुलर कीवर्ड हियर इज द कोर दैट वी हैव टू अप्लाई द कोर मीनिंग ऑफ दैट डायरेक्टिव दैट मींस व्हाट इज द कोर ऑफ द मीनिंग ऑफ द डिस्क्राइब व्हाट इज द कोर ऑफ द indication of this discuss व्हेन वी से डिस्कस व्हाट इज द मीनिंग ऑफ द डिस्कस वी हैव टू रिकवर द कोर core of the discuss core meaning of that particular directive what is the core meaning of this particular term explain we have to uh, first uh, recover the core meaning of that particular term after it we have to apply that meaning in our answer right when we say explain i told you that here we have to apply scientific data or scientific research that does not mean that uh, we have to go to the american journal and we have to refer to the american journal that is not the thing the matter is that 
in comparison to discuss when we use the or, or when we find the directive explain that means in comparison to the discuss in explain our decision our conclusion have to be based on some kind of very relevant information or relevant data or research that is the meaning right and that does not also mean that key you have to fill up your answer with all the information with all the data right you paste in each concept not data but you have to give a conjugal effort of concept and data right that is that is why i told you that uh, watch the video till the end otherwise otherwise you will think that key explain means you have to fill the on answer script you have to fill the answer with a data only no that is not the thing i am going to uh, tell you ki mera kehne ka matlab ye hai ki when we find the term explain ki we have to give a conclude uh, we have to conclude our answer on the basis of some very uh, concrete data or some very relevant information and we have to uh, we have to give concept on the basis of that those information right for example you see uh explain explain means ki give more sufficient information to come to the decision and when you say information it is not that you have to uh, find out or some uh, scientific research scientific journal no that does not mean it means you have to give some information picked up from ncert some supreme court decision surveys government or non governmental reports etc means your decision must have to be based on this kind of information right and you have to apply a particular kind of analyzing it is based on comparison and you have to throw more light on the complex or concerned aspects of the so as a whole in explain we have to give some relevant information we have to apply analyzing we have to make comparison we have to throw light on the complex or concerned aspects and we have to give a clarity of thought right in that way, when we find the term describe it means a general view encompassing as a whole we have to give a general account of the ask topic in the question and when we find the term discuss first we have to keep it in mind that we have to give causes consequences merit and demerit but all this information and our conclusion should be based on one or two particular evidences right so discuss and explain both are near to the meaning but explain once more clarity of thought more exam based approach and more relevant information more clarity of thought and more uh, thro throwing light on the complex or darker aspects of the topic and here you have to develop a very clear understanding of the topic but in discuss you ha you have to focus more on the causes consequences and general merits and demerits of the topic by uh, on the basis of some particular Uh, evidences or particular information and describe does not need this kind of rigorous information it simply asks it simply wants from you the general overview of the topic then let's discuss this with an example when when i say discuss always keep remember the, uh, that i will be bring some special evidence that means discuss means i will refer to some special evidence take in quest take a question discuss the alternative dispute redressal mechanism in india discuss the alternative dispute redressal mechanism in india we are asked to discuss in our answer that means what we have to focus more on the alternative dispute redressal mechanism showing some special evidence and how we can put up those special evidence that why we need uh, alternative dispute redressal mechanism right we have to give evidence of that what are the merits and demerits we have to put some special evidence we have to put some reference and with the help of those reference we have to show the merits and demerits of a, a alternative dispute redressal mechanism discuss the alternative dispute redressal mechanism in india that means what we have to bring some special evidence to prove that why we need a special uh, alternative dispute redressal mechanism what are their merits and demerits we have to prove all this with some special points then again replace the word discuss with explain explain the alternative red, uh, dispute redressal mechanism in india 
when we find the word explain in exam hall in question then we have to think that it is asked for examination that means here we need clarity of thought and how we can put up clarity of thought we have to bring some comparison and we have to bring some complex aspects focusing more on the solution focusing more on the problematic areas or demerits right means we have to put up some evidence and data which are very specific and which are very airtight right some scientific kind of research we have to more focus on evidence and we have to more establish the relationship between those evidence and their uh, concerns so when we say complain when we find that sorry explain the uh, alternative re uh, dispute reduction mechanism in india then what will be the structure of our answer here we have to show that why we need alternative dispute reduction system how they are working and what are their deficiencies and all these points we have to prove with scientific data with evidence and this uh uh, uh, we have to tilt, we have to tilt, uh, tilt means we have to turn this scientific data and we have to turn this evidence showing more on the complex sides of the alternative dispute reducer mechanism. That means more emphasis on the darker sides, that means the some problems. What are the some problems of alternative dispute reducer mechanism? What are the some concerns of alternative dispute reduction mechanism? It might be the lack of judges. It might be lack of, lack of efficient administration. In this way, the darker aspects, the concerns, the problems, the deficiencies of alternative dispute reduction system. We have to focus more on that. But keep it in mind, we need clarity of thought and we need examination based answer. That means we have to show special evidence and we can also compare the alternative dispute reduction system of mechanism in India with that of other countries. Then now you see how discuss and explain this one word how change the whole requirement of the question. When we find the word discuss, we have to put some specific data or evidence. It need not to be much more concrete or it need not to be much more scientific. Here we must must not have to be more focused on the darker or complex aspects. Here we have not to go much more towards comparison. Right. But when we find the word explain, here it uh, asks for, for clarity of thought. That means here we have to focus more on the complex sites, deficiencies. We have to put forward solutions we have to bring up comparison then when we simply find the word described here it asks for simply giving an account that means if we find the word describe the alternative re dispute reduction mechanism in India that means it asks for simply giving an account why we need the alternative dispute reduction system how they work or we can simply put forward a solution how we can give suggestions to improve the admin improve this system in this way the word discuss describe and explain these words actually seems the whole requirement of the question so hope i think you are clear now regarding these three words do not make mistakes in future whenever we find discuss always keep it in mind we have to bring some special evidence we have to show merit and demerit but it should not be much more scientific right we have to bring a simple um, evidence right to prove our point but when we find explain we have to bring much more rigorous evidence scientific data research examination based answer right here we have to put more focus on the complex or deficiencies and when we find describe we have to simply give an account of the why how or some simple solutions right hope you are clear now i will become again with another video till then take care and bye bye